In this lesson, we are going to find the common multiples of two whole numbers. So the learning objective is to find common multiples and, least co and the least common multiple of two whole numbers. So let's get started. So we are first going to find the first two common multiples of 8 and 12. First, let's find all of the multiples of 8, and then we'll look at the multiples of 12. So let's start with our multiples of 8. So for my multiples, I'm going to start with 1, and I know that 1 times 8 equals 8. So that's my first multiple. Then I'm going to go to 2, so 2 times 8 equals 16. 3 times 8 equals 24. 4 times 8 equals 32, 5 times 8 equals 35, oops, no it doesn't, it equals 40, equals 40, 6 times 8 equals 48, 7 times 8 equals 56, 8 times 8 equals 64, and 9 times 8 equals 72, and 10 times 8 equals 80. So that'll get us started. Now let's look at some multiples of 12. So my multiples of 12, if I have, oops, if I have 1 times 12 will give you 12, so that's your first one. Your second multiple, 2 times 12 is 24, 3 times 12 is 36, 4 times 12 is 48, 5 times 12 equals 60, 6 times 12 equals 72, 7 times 12 equals 84, 8 times 12 equals 96, 9 times 12 equals 108, and 10 times 12 equals 120. So my multiples of 8 are 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, and 80. So those are my first 10 multiples of 8. Now my multiples of 12 are 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96, 108, and 200. So we need to look to see which multiples are in both the list of multiples of 8 and my multiples of 12. So I'm going to take my blue and now I'm going to go through and I'm going to look to see if I can find any multiples that are in both lists. The first thing that I see is this 28, or 24, sorry, is in both of them. Now going down, the next one I see is 48. Oh, and then I see a 72. And then that looks like that's all I have based off the list of multiples of 8 that I have. So my first three common multiples of 8 and 12, or I was looking just for the first two common multiples. So my first two common multiples would be 24 and 48. So 24 and 48 would be my solution to this problem.